All right, today we're going to talk about statistical questions. And in order for a question to be statistical, one, you have to get a numerical answer. So the answer has to be a number. And two, you have to be able to get more than one number. So let's look at a couple of these questions. So if I just ask the question, how old are you? You could give me an answer of, you know, 12. That's how old you are. That's only one number. So it's not statistical. If I asked how tall is Mount Everest, you could give me an answer of 29,029 feet. Again, only one number is the correct answer, so that question is not statistical. How many counties are in Texas? There's 254. Again, only one answer, so that is not statistical. If I ask the question, how tall is each person in class? <clears throat> I could get answers like um, 55 inches, 60 inches, 58 inches. So I'm getting more than one number. So this is statistical because there are multiple answers that are all numbers. The next thing you need to know is how to determine a biased versus an unbiased question. So bias just means you're trying to get people to feel a certain way or answer a certain way. So I got a couple biased questions there and we're going to look at those and then look at the unbiased questions to see the difference. So bias, do you like pretty pink or boring blue? And the other one, would you rather go on a fun bike ride or watch boring TV? So those are biased. Unbiased would be do you prefer purple or orange? And what is your favorite number? So the key difference between the two different questions is in the way you're asking them. So I'm going to underline my biased question or the part that makes it biased in my biased questions. And you'll notice what I'm underlining is pretty, boring, fun, and boring. And you'll notice those are all adjectives. So, an unbiased question is not going to have any adjectives in it uh, to get people to feel one way or another about the question. So, do you prefer purple or orange? It's just a question and people can answer it uh, how they choose. But when you ask the question, do you like pretty pink or boring blue, you're trying to get people to say pink. So, to be unbiased, just don't have any adjectives in your question. Thank <laughs> you.